एट ईयर्स नाइन ईयर्स बैक आई गॉट आई ब्रोक माई आर्म आई फेल आई थिंक सम फिफ्टीन फीट और समथिंग आई फेल डाउन एंड आई ब्रोक माई आर्म टू ब्रोक सो फ्रॉम दैट मोमेंट आफ्टर द ट्रीटमेंट आई स्टार्ट डेवलपिंग दिस फोबिया ऑफ नो वर्टिको हाइट सो एंड देन वेन दिस पीपल टोल मी लाइक यू जस्ट हैव टू हॉइस्ट ऑफ फ्लैग हाई हाइस्ट ऑफ फ्लैग आई हैप्पीली केम दे टू द सेट्स दे मैंने केम दे शो मी दिस टॉल टेम्पल आई मीन यू हैव टू क्लाइम देर एंड हॉइस द फ्लैग एंड आई थिंक इट वॉज वेरी स्कैरी आई आई थिंक इवन फॉर अ पर्सन हु डजन हैव वर्टिको विल बी स्केर ऑफ दैट काइंड ऑफ हाइट बट एनी वाई इट वॉज very scary and you know i somehow we did it and vishal sir the cameraman he wanted me to be comfortable so he climbed with me till the end and he was there with me till we finished shooting that episode and when i started this film i i was i didn't know how to ride a scooter mere piche baithna pade main break maru to mere upar girna padega girlfriend na sahi feel hi de de scooter is also you know it belongs to the culture of banaras kundan and his scooter should be inseparable by the end of the film now i'm an expert i can do wheeling and all it was tough there's no h in the language tamil so ghar and uh, bhabhi that that it's it in tamil when you said it will be babi there there's no h in tamil here a lot of hs in the in the lines i found it really tough especially when i was dubbing it was very very tough but uh, yeah i had very good guides uh, himanshu the writer was with me throughout waqt de raha hu tumhe haste ke haste ke liye hue main haste waqt de raha hu haste hue waqt de varna hota ke bich chala सोनम वॉज रियली रियली स्वीट टू मी ऑन सेट्स एंड शी मेड श्योर I'm okay. She made sure that I'm comfortable, and uh, she kept help helping me on the spot. And since I don't know the language, I had to trouble everybody so much. I realized how much Hindi I speak and how much I think in Hindi as soon as Dhanush came into my life. As North Indians, we switch from Hindi to English, Hindi to English to Hindi without realizing it. You know, we speak English, and I think I think so. We I would try to translate it to him all the time because I was always conscious of the fact that he didn't speak the language.